Hey everyone, this is Roy, and by the end of the video, you will know the top 5 paying companies for software engineers that pay really well in India, SD1 and SD2 engineers. The like target of this video is 25 likes, so hit the like button and do make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel for more such content. Everyone loves to get paid for the work that they do, and no one likes to be lowballed in any situation. And in a country where it's popular to ask your previous compensation before even rolling out an offer is ridiculous. To get a high pay, one of the most popular ways to get a higher package is to get a competing offer in the first place. In order to do this, you need to know which company is paying a higher compensation. If you want to know how I did the research, you can watch my other video on how to find a salary ranges by clicking on the top right corner of the screen. To save time, I've added timestamp in the description so you can easily go to the part of the video that you are most interested in. I have sorted the companies based on one factor only and that is in-hand cash component at the end of the year. Now, this contains the stocks which are public and the cash component that you are going to get at the end of the year. I am also going to share the in-hand monthly income. Now this is under consideration that you are not optimizing for taxes or not doing any tax deduction at all. At the time of making this video, I am using the old tax regime where the first 5 lakhs is not taxed, 20% income tax for the next 5 lakhs and the rest of the amount is taxed at 30%. I know this is not an accurate way of estimating the in-hand salary. You can assume that there will be some things that can offset due to EPF contributions to personal tax as well. So number five on the list is Twitter. Twitter is a microblogging and a social networking service on which users post and interact with messages known as tweets. The base salary is 21 lakhs, the stocks is 6 to 8 lakhs, and the bonus is 3 to 5 lakhs. So the total is 30 to 34 lakhs per year. And the in-hand salary which you would be get is approximately 1.9 lakhs to 2.15 lakhs per month. The fourth company on the list is Goldman Sachs. I might be pronouncing that wrong, but it is an American multinational investment bank and financial services company headquarters in New York. The base salary is 22 lakhs, the stocks is zero, the bonus is 7 to 11 lakhs, and the total is 29 to 33 lakhs per year. And the in-hand salary is 1.8 to 2 lakhs per month. Now on the third place is Google. Now Google does not need the introduction, so I'll just dive in. Base is 19 to 32 lakhs, stocks is 3 to 7 lakhs per year and bonus is 1.9 to 3.2 lakhs per year and total compensation per year is 22 to 39 lakhs. The in-hand salary is 1.45 lakhs to 2.4 lakhs per month. The second place is DShow. DShow is a company headquartered in the US which is known for developing mathematical models and computer programs to exploit anomalies in the financial market. The base salary is 28 lakhs, the stocks is 0 to 5 lakhs, the bonus is 7 lakhs and the total is 35 to 40 lakhs per year. The in-hand salary is 2.2 to 2.5 lakhs per month. Now, on the first place for SD1 or software engineers is Sprinkler. Sprinkler is an American company that develops a SaaS customer experience management platform. Base package is 30 lakhs, the stocks is 0 to 15 lakhs, the bonus is 0 and the total is 30 to 45 lakhs per year. The in-hand salary is 1.9 to 2.8 lakhs per month. Now let's dive into the top 5 companies for SD2 engineers. Do note that if you stay for the same company for 2 to 3 years, and you get an internal promotion, then your salary would be a bit lesser than the lateral hire who just joined the company as an SD2 engineer at two to three years of experience. Now this compensation is for people who have two to five years of experience. Now the fifth place is Microsoft. I'm sure that this company does not need any introduction, so I'll just dive in deep. The base is 21 to 28 lakhs, the stocks is 4 to 31 lakhs, and the bonus is 0 to 2 lakhs. The total compensation is 27 lakhs to 59 lakhs, and the in-hand salary is 1.7 to 3.6 lakhs per month. Now on the fourth place is Amazon. Now note that the years of experience and previous pay will matter. Base is 28 to 46 lakhs, stocks is up to 10 lakhs, the bonus is 2 to 9 lakhs and the total is 40 lakhs to 65 lakhs per year. In hand compensation would be 2.5 lakhs to 3.9 lakhs per month. On the third place we have Confluent. Confluent is a big data company founded by three LinkedIn engineers. So the base compensation is 45 to 50 lakhs, the stocks is 19 to 22 lakhs, the bonus is 4.5 to 5 lakhs, and the total is 68 to 77 lakhs per year. The in-hand compensation is 4.13 to 4.65 per month. 
On the second place, we have D-Show. This company has already been introduced in the SD1 part, so I'll skip it. The base is 30 to 62 lakhs. The stocks can be zero. The bonus is 3 to 24 lakhs, and the total is 33 to 86 lakhs per year. The in-hand compensation is 2.10 lakhs to 5.18 lakhs per month. On the first place, we have Uber. Now, Uber is a mobility as a service which allows users to book a car. The base compensation is 30 to 60 lakhs. The stocks is 8 to 38 lakhs and the bonus is 3 to 13 lakhs. The total compensation per year is 41 lakhs to 1.4 crores a year. In hand salary, you would be getting 2.5 lakhs to 5.5 lakhs per month. I hope you like this video. If you feel that there is any other company that should have been on the list, do let me know in the comment section below and this will also help other viewers who are watching this video. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more such content.